20 yard line and they'll begin with an empty backfield with Breeze taking the snap five receivers go out and the first pass of the game is incomplete tries to go to Marcus Colson covered there by Bailey second and seven from the 48 Breeze that shoulder turn and then he hits Colston who's just had a tremendous run from the end of September on and he has a first down of the 36 yard line on a gain of 16 yards give David Thomas a little credit here they're gonna try and block him with Roby coming off the edge but David Thomas just enough and Drew Brees sort of like an Aaron Rodgers type of play able to move around enough to buy a little time and get that completion in but the movement skills of Drew Brees as he peeks over the top of his offensive lineman there. The difference on that one. Colston is number one receiver. That's his 36th catch of the season. Second down and 10. Thank you, Michelle. One guy there minus as well. The wideout Joseph Morgan has turned into a big play guy. But he has a chest injury and is out tonight as Brees on second and 10 fires over the middle and that's a 15-yard gain. Marcus Colston, the fourth to last guy drafted in 06 out of Hofstra. And Colston has just been red hot lately. Over the last three games, 25 catches, 357 yards, and five touchdowns. No Saints receiver ever has put together a three-game stretch like that. And they'll have to do it again to try to get themselves back into the playoff run. Big difference, obviously, between three and four and two and five at this point this season. Is to the outside goes Thomas, but nothing happened in there. No game. One of the more remarkable things you'll see is Champ Bailey, after however many years he's been in the league, playing the run. Drew Brees was talking to us about it. He said, usually as guys get older, that's the part of the game that begins to fade. You know, they still cover guys, but they're not as interested in getting involved in the run game. The reason Champ Bailey's going into the Hall of Fame one day is... Way through the third quarter. Crowd stomping its feet. Third and four. And over the middle, and that is a nice catch by Colston. He beats Bailey. <laughs> and he said, man, I had him covered. Not well enough, first down. Boy, what a throw. You got Doomerville on the outside and the Pro Bowler Bushrod on him, and that's a nice job scrambling around. Drew Brees. We were talking to Marcus Colston yesterday, and he said, is there ever a time that you don't see the ball come out? He said, yeah, it looks like it just comes out of a pile of offensive linemen sometimes. From the 50. Only a three-man rush. And Breeze will throw, and it's a little high and incomplete. So they had eight guys back in coverage. You had Vickerson, who was chasing Breeze, who gave him a shot at the end of the play. Third and six. Good coverage on the back end. Chris Harris, the outstanding young nickelback, who's playing the night for... Tracy Porter but on the other side it was Colston who was open he came back made a late adjustment was open and Breeze just missed him really should have had him we talked about Marcus Colston on the outside and he has just been red hot lately watch Champ Bailey I'm gonna cut him off at the spot we see Revis do that a lot in New York when he was healthy and you try to release inside he jams you trying to release outside he cuts you off very unsaints like almost every year this is Jack Del Rio's group right now. Well, they're really coming of age tonight. Third down and eight. And that pass is intended for Colston. The Broncos are saying he's out of bounds. And the officials agree. Right there in front of the Bronco bench. He's on the stripe. Incomplete fourth down. Jam Bailey has no fear whatsoever that Colston's going to run by him. So he's playing this back shoulder fade. It's one of the problems. I think he caught it. Did he get his feet down? Well, that's the problem the right there. Right. And remember, even though the toe was down, it is the old heel-toe thing. Right. And, you know, so once that heel comes down on the line, that's it. Right now, his team is one of the hotter teams in the National Football League. Second and ten. And that's taken by Marcus Colston, who gets 
tackle by Trevathan, and it will be third down and one. So many good players on the defensive side, and remarkably, Champ Bailey still getting it done at such a high level. Holston's been so hot coming into this game, and he just has been a non-factor. Champ has been all over him, but even in the run game, look at this. The old man coming up. There you go. How about a little ride on the Ferris wheel? Hayden, because they just really felt like they wanted to go another direction. Meanwhile, Breeze in the throw pocket expired, but there's no delay, and then he throws, and it's Colston making the catch, and that will be a first down. So Breeze, they got away with one there, because the play clock was at zero when they snapped it. Yeah, watch Jim Leonard come off the edge here. He's going to get a big shot on Drew Breeze, but Breeze still able to fit that one in.